Our brother Thomas was on tour with a band, also together with a company, a rental company called Soundlab, and he was a roadie. And this time he found out that cables are not available in Germany. Every year, about around Christmas, my brother Dieter, me and Thomas met our parents in Nuremberg. He talked about what he's doing with his new plans, with his new ideas, and this was an idea so it was good. A nice idea, let's also do something in the audio business. And then Dieter and we start to produce empty loudspeaker cabinets. 1988, we moved with our company from Munich to Würzburg. 1995, there was a big change in Klaus' company. We sold the loudspeaker company to an investor. Dieter, Stefan and me are the owner of Klotz AIS. We start with the cable business. When I joined Klotz AIS uh, back in 1999, it was a small company with a few employees on the production side and a small sales marketing team back in Munich. 20 years later, we are looking at a company which has grown substantially actually with slightly more than 100 employees with a product range which is massive. It has been a great, great challenge for us, but at the same same time a big success story. In our industry many companies are founded from families. Also very important for us in a family business is the fact that employees stay longer. A lot of our employees here are more than the same time in the company as we are and this makes us very proud. We are present in 130 countries worldwide, so we are very proud of this. We have an excellent relationship with our customers. I know of customers and distributors who have been um, with Klotz actually 40 years since day one of the company, and it has grown to such a relationship where it's not only about business. Of course, we do business and we all do the business together. In many, many cases, it has even grown to really friendships. I mean, we know each other so long. I mean, 40 years, 20 years, whatever. Um, this has really grown into friendships and we have such a nice uh, relationship to our customers and we can be very proud of all our partners and customers and our so-called Klotz family members to be part of this whole project. Production processes have changed, as I mentioned before, in terms of when we look back 20 years, it was a lot of handmade soldering of the cables and lots of handcraft involved and it was not well organized in the sense of a, of a streamlined production process. And over the years, as the business grew and the product range grew substantially, we had to get self-organized and we implemented a production planning system. We are fully ISO certified company since more than 10 years now. We live this every day and every minute actually and we love what we do. I cannot say that there is one single specific highlight, it's more the whole mix of everything. We are actually a very human-based company and have a good understanding for each other. The highlights, to talk with our customers, and they are so happy with our products. This is, makes us very proud, the whole Klotz family. The future of Klotz is definitely not going to be wireless. We are aiming to keep all our products and production processes at the highest level standards. And we like to do this. We eat cables, we smell cables. Every day, it's our daily business and daily mission, and we love what we do. Our plan is to invest our money in a new plant, in a new factory. Also, we want to make much higher quality as we do today. This is our idea always by Klotz. We are on a very good level, but we want to make it much better. This is our ideas for the future.